Assalamu alaikum dear viewers, this is Takim Murlik and this is my bike Renault Turbo. I have been using this bike about 3 years, so it could be a review on this bike. Let's get started. First, I'll start with negative marking. Something wrong with its chain cover. Original chain quality was very bad. That's why. I have changed it very early. It's frustrating that in local market I didn't find its parts like tail light. Although the tail light hasn't any problem, I got an accident so it broken down. But I had to wait for the tail light for a month and now have to change clutch cable and rear brake shoe that is also not available in local market i'm very unhappy with its original tire quality many of users claim with its large wheel diameter but i don't think so i like large wheel than conventional well who are watching this review i hope they all know about its detail specification so i'm not going on detail just sharing what i have experienced with this bike it's a commuter segment bike with good features outlook is not punky but gentle enough its wheelbase is 1320 millimeter which gives me high speed stability but ground clearance is 160 millimeter according to wheel diameter i expected a little more ground clearance front and rear suspension is hydraulic telescopic and coil spring hydraulic with five stages adjustment and snack driving seat gives me ease on long drive turning radius of steering is very good so i can easily turn the bike within very short space its unladen weight is 129 kg so with front disc plus dead drum brake and adequate weight gives a good braking From my experience, manual choking system is better than automatic. Here is the Turbo's choke lever. Many of bikes choke is mount with engine, so that will make your hand dirty. Turbo's air filter is dry air filter which is called high performance air filter. It's better than oil air filter. Engine oil dip stick. It helps me understand the condition of engine oil. Spacious and user-friendly toolbox. Turbo has an exceptional feature that is keyhole locker. All illumination work beyond ignition kill switch which helps me reduce fuel consumption in city drive i got around 55 km per liter but total response is good i love its engine sound it don't generate vibration and noise 
when I drive with a very high throttle, even with passenger. One thing I like most that its engine idle RPM fluctuates a very little. I didn't experience engine seize with this bike. Clutch gear lever accelerator is very loose, so it gives me comfort. Let's have a look on dashboard. Here is an analog tachometer and in LCD fuel gauge speedometer gear odometer trip meter one thing interesting here that is runner gave two options here to see speedometer odometer and trip meter either kilometer unit or miles which is impressive after considering its price economy fuel consumption as well as good and bad features it is a good bike I'll let this bike 8 out of 10. See you in another video inshallah. Till then, take care and Allah peace.